a new open source AI image generator is here. It is called Flux CreaDev. This model is an upgrade to the well-known Flux and it sets a new standard for making realistic images using text prompts. Flux CreaDev can create photos that look real and a little bit imperfect, just like pictures taken with a phone by a regular person. The main improvement of Flux CreaDev is in realism. Earlier versions of Flux would sometimes make pictures that were too perfect. Faces looked too smooth and shiny. Backgrounds were always neat and bright. This new model changes that. With Flux CreaDev, images have more grain and blur around the edges. They look natural, as if they came from a real camera, not a computer. Let's look at what Flux CreaDev can do. When you ask it for an amateur photo of a woman, it gives you a picture that looks like someone took a snapshot with their phone. The background is a little messy and blurred. The lighting is not always perfect. This is what a real photo looks like. The previous version, Flux Dev, would create a face that looks smooth and almost plastic. The background looked like professional studio photos, not something casual. You can give more details in your prompts. Ask for an amateur photo of a nerdy woman with messy hair, round glasses, freckles and braces at the library. Flux Crea Dev pays attention to all these details. The result is a woman with messy hair and braces. There are freckles, even if there are slightly too many. She looks more like a real person. But Flux Dev, the older version, misses the braces and tends to make images look a bit like cartoons. The faces do not feel as unique or detailed. Try a prompt like a woman riding a bus looking out the window. Flux Crea Dev makes a picture that looks like it could be from anyone's daily commute. You see imperfections and the normal blur from taking a photo on a moving bus. It even adds chromatic effects and small window smudges. On the other hand, Flux Dev gives a clean, perfectly framed and oversaturated result. A school yearbook is another good test. When you ask it to make a page from a school yearbook, Flux Crea Dev makes a grid of faces that all look a little different. The text is still just fake scribbles, as with most AI image models, but from a distance, the photo looks real. The older Flux Dev often repeats some faces and uses the same skin tone across many students. The page looks unnatural. Flux Crea Dev is better for scenes that are supposed to look candid or low quality, like people dancing at a nightclub with harsh flash. It creates a moody, realistic picture, and the mood is just right. You can almost hear the music. The older model makes everything neat and colorful with no realism. You can ask for detailed city scenes too. Try urban rooftop garden in LA with succulents, string lights, and a cat sleeping on the ledge. With Flux Crea Dev, you get string lights that really hang, backgrounds with city haze, and a cat that blends into the scene. Even if a string light is not perfectly connected, it feels real. Flux Dev makes the same image look bright and cartoonish. The model does well with action and wide-angle shots like an ultra-wide fisheye photo of a skateboarder at a skate park. Both versions manage to do it, but Flux Crea Dev keeps the colors calm and makes the skin and clothing look more true to life. Faces do sometimes have issues, but the whole photo fits together. To test variety, prompt for a group of dogs dressed as world leaders having a debate. Flux Crea Dev creates detailed and believable dogs, although it seems to prefer retrievers. Images of snowy mountains, twilight skies, have better light and depth in Flux Crea Dev than before. The colors are soft and everything fits together. It is not only for people and landscapes. Try prompts like a Mini Cooper, a black Porsche 911, and a green Tesla Roadster racing on city streets at night. Flux Crea Dev succeeds in creating cars that are recognizable by brand and shape. The tool is not perfect. Sometimes hands or feet get strange or anatomy is slightly off. As with most AI models, text in images still looks jumbled. For rare animals like spectral tarsiers, the model guesses and sometimes produces inaccurate results. Flux Crea Dev also excels in creative and abstract tasks. Ask for movie posters, rough pencil sketches, a whale swimming through clouds over a quiet town, or even scenes in famous art styles like Manet or Pixar animation. The model keeps details, gets the emotions right, and adapts to new styles quickly. Prompt complexity is not an issue. Describe a ballerina spinning in a sunny studio with mirrors, sheets of music, point shoes, a rabbit on a grand piano, and an elephant on a circus ball outside the window. Flux Crea Dev manages to put most of these things in the picture. The scene might not be perfect, the elephant might float, but it's packed with details you actually prompted. If you want to use Flux Crea Dev, you do not need to install anything. You can use the online platform for free. Each day you get several image generations without even signing up. If you create a free account, you get extra daily credits. 
There's also a free hugging face space where you just write your prompt and generate images at no cost. Both options are available and linked in the video description. Overall, Flux Crea Dev stands out among open source models. It can generate images that blend realism with imperfection. Results are closer to what you would expect from real life, not just polished media. There are some limits, but for everyday creativity, portraits, animals, city scenes, artistic prompts, and even fantasy images, this tool can deliver impressive results. All the links, including where to use it online, models to download, and more info, are in the description. Give Flux Crea Dev a try and see how real AI images can look. And for more honest reviews and hands-on AI demos every week, subscribe and stay tuned for the next video.